Hi everyone! Thank you for coming back for more of my streamlined story-only playthrough of Dragon Age 2. Wasting no time, I'm currently working through a quest called Prime Suspect. We are really knee-deep into, <laughs> into this game at this point. We're in the game's second act. And I am, if I recall, I'm to leave here. And we have to go meet um, Emmerich in Lowtown. Oh, in a blind alley. <laughs> off of Lowtown. He was investigating some murders and we met his potential suspect, Gascard, last time, but we let him go. Hmm. Not sure how that's going to turn out, but we'll see if Emmerich has anything to say on the matter. As he's the one who's been... Oops! That would probably be Emmerich right there. Huh. Well, so much for that. Oh my goodness. Always with the demons. So many. I should probably use my force mage powers in a more... <laughs> in a better fashion than that. Still practicing. Oh, I could also... I forget, I also have my Mabari at hand. Let's bring him in. Since I'm now a party of two mages, a warrior, and a rogue, having the additional hands-on help will be a good thing. Get the hell out of there, fool! Damn. That was it? Mage sent that thing here to kill him. Why would anyone? Oh, Maker. The murders. Emmerich was right. He was getting too close. He suspected a man named Gascard Dupuis. Did he do this? Gascard played me. And now he's escaped to Darktown. Darktown's a big place, but we'll find him. He's an apostate, and Meredith will want him hunted down. I will speak to the city guard about this. Gascard Dupuy will not escape. My men will cooperate however they can. Tell them I command it. Thank you, Captain. All right. Well, that completed that quest. Poor Emmerich. He didn't really deserve that. Hopefully they'll find Gascard feel bad now that I let the fool go but in any event all right well let's go ahead and leave and I suppose well actually before I leave let me pick another quest since that completed that um so we have the Cunari and the Cunari so <laughs> so I don't really know if it matters which one we take so uh, let's just head on out and see if our map tells us one way or the other Actually, I don't know that Demands of the Kuhn is a quest so much as a, a sort of a <laughs> direction as to what we have to complete in this particular part of the game. So we'll go back. It looks like Black Powder Courtesy is what we'll be following it for the moment. So we'll go talk to the Arashok. It has been three years, apparently, since we last saw him. The alienage is overcrowded. Someone's distant. Here's the compound. I was a little distracted by that quest giving Cunari. But there we go. Here is what we need to do and who we need to talk to. Sarah Hawk. Messer? Last we met, I did not know your name. Did not care to. You have changed your fortune over the years. The Kunari have not. I offer a courtesy, Hawk. Someone has stolen what he thinks is the formula for Gatlock. You will want to hunt him. Sounds like the recovery should be worth something to me. 
a thousand lives. A stolen formula was a decoy. Sarkamek, a poison gas, not explosives. A small amount is dangerous enough to your kind, but if made in quantity, perhaps by someone intending to sell it. <clears throat> that merchant, Javaris. Would he be cautious? Or would he assume success and make enough to threaten a district? A courtesy hawk. You will want to hunt him. Ooh, let's ask Varric. Any idea where we can find Javaris? I heard about a sell-off. Merchant territories and such. They don't do that unless someone left in a hurry. I'd have figured he'd rook some noble. He's sure not a burglar. Just tell me where he is. I haven't kept up on the squirt. Ask the coterie. Panahedon, Hawk. It will be interesting to see if you die. <laughs> well, okay, that's, uh... <laughs> one response. All right, so let's see what the quest then says. Go to the coterie in Darktown to find out where Jars is gone. Well, that's exactly what... Um, Barak said. To Dark Town we go. Javaris. I should have kicked him in the head when he had a chance. <laughs> oh. Now, the market is not that far away. What am I? Beg your pardon? You don't call anyone by name except for me. Where's my nickname? That's not true. There's Hawk and Bianca. Hawk is a family name, and Bianca is a crossbow. Don't change the subject. Haven't thought of a good one yet. What do you think of Red? Too common. Well, when you think of one, let me know. <laughs> uh, Aveline, so, so wonderful. All right, the coterie barker. There we go. Selling the assets of Javaris Tintop. We are limited district, limited contracts. Keeps territory clear and separate from the start. He had a meager lot, but he skipped with dues outstanding. So up it goes. There's a lot riding on finding Javaris. Can you help? The members of our little fellowship expect privacy. But he skipped out on paying me, too. Javaris left in a hurry. I'd put him at Smuggler's Cup if he's avoiding patrols. It empties at a cave outside town. Tell him I said, don't come back. Not the trail I'd expect oh, from a master nice. thief. Just saying. Hmm. Does seem a little obvious, but uh, at least the place where we need to go is not far away. All right, Javaris, here we come. Down into the caves we go. And where am I going? This way? Or, well, yes. Maybe this way. Those are most helpful powers when nobody was around to help me. Crap, there's more. <laughs> there's always more. At least two waves, if not three, every time you run into a mob. 
Guess I should know by now. Wait, what did I attack? Oh. <laughs> A lot of red dots popping up there. Okay. Uh, let's see where. This way? This way. And I'm trying, trying to follow the right way around. No matter how familiar it all looks, it doesn't make it any less mazy. Yeah. Oh, get him, doggy. I don't get to give my dog a name in this game. <laughs> Just has to be there to help. I should remember to summon him at the start of every particular level like this. But. Frankly, it's just good that I remember <laughs> the general path of the quests. That's difficult enough. There's a lot of folks. Okay, so... Grab some... Hmm, I still don't think... Hard stone. I wish I'd worn shoes with soles now. Not yet, Farrick. Still is not high enough. That's all right. I'm finding plenty to keep me well equipped and busy enough. Nice work. Actually, this new outfit set is keeping me nicely armored, too. I think it's over too. All right, we're close. Oh, crap, I can't go into the wilderness yet. Not until I take care of these fellows. Damn, that's a whole nother part of the map down there. Go exploring. Hmm. Too bad that's not my goal here. <laughs> Come on, we're just trying to get to Javaris. Stop him from killing the entire city. There's plenty of time for that later. Alright, I can't stop myself from grabbing sparkles. I'm with you. Thanks, Aveline. I'm with you too. Alright, now let's get the hell out of here. <laughs> and on into the wilderness. Sounds great. <laughs> okay, let's get myself in a better position here. I wanted to actually didn't I what what am what, what the hell was that? Oh, I don't have it. I see. I'm out of <laughs> ah, Something invisible in the terrain would not allow me to move. It's always great when that happens. All right. 
right. Calm yourself, Jabba. Weasel. You're not dead yet. <laughs> you? Granny's garters, she would hire you. I can't buy a break on discount. You know what? Go ahead. Take my head and pike it back to that sodding elf. I need the rest. The canary powder. It's not what you think. It's poison. Wait. You're tracking for the canary. Then she did it. That elf got them after me for nothing. Bitch born. Ah, I knew he was no burglar. We're not climbers. Look, I'm minding business. <laughs> Same then out of the blue, some elf tries to kill me. Says she's got the canary powder and I'm her cover. I slipped her, hired some bodyguards, and ran for it. And now you're here. Great. If you're innocent, you could plead your case to the Arashok. Let's break this down. An elf with explosives wants me dead. Part two, the Kanari may think I'm a thief and also want me dead. Either option seem promising? Didn't think so. Here. <laughs> Wanna drag Dark into life? I had a man follow her. The elf's in low town. I just want to get out with my dead guards. Thanks for that. Better luck wherever you're bound, Javaris. The farther, the better. Right. Got me a rosy future to plan out. Think I'll start by selling some boots. Sodding bunch of... Take a long breath on a short shaft, you blasted dog lord in rotors. <laughs> oh, just so ridiculous. All right, well. That's Javaris, ladies and gentlemen. Okay, so let's find... Let's see... If we can't find this mysterious elf who's causing all sorts of havoc, good night. Can't catch a break in Kirkwall. Always somebody trying to do something stupid. <laughs> but I suppose that's just part of the charm. And it at least keeps Hawk busy. All of you, I can't fight the damned air. You want to live, stay out. What's going on, Mason? God, Captain, there's... I can't even describe. On your time, son. Reports of some haze with a stench of rust and throw up. There was a cloud, then a lingering mist. Anyone caught in the cloud just went mad. Then the others just wretched themselves dead. All right, keep your post. We'll take it from here. He's a good man. Trust that it's as bad as he says. Let's hope this elf didn't try to make enough powder to sell. Didn't sound like a merchant to me. Let's go. Maker. Awesome. That's what we do. So there are various steel latches around <laughs> the um, area here that we have to work through. Now the poison is <laughs> very slowly doing its thing. And there's not really um, too much worry about dying from it specifically. However, the people who have been affected by it, unfortunately, are problematic. So, I can never remember where these, these stupid latches are. Uh, let's see. Can easily see the barrels. Nothing there. All right. Around the other side. For chance. God, where the fuck are they? <laughs> Nope, not that way. I get it, Varric. It's not like they all are just on the ground. They 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 pop up, and maybe it's after we defeat a wave of enemies. That's why you know the the stuff is not super deadly. I'll take comfort in his certainty. There we go. There's another one that popped up. This should do the trick. Oh, 
Well, one barrel, okay. That's another one. So back out for more fighting. I mean, look, the game might have a really excellent story, but <laughs> it's not perfect. It's not a perfect game. You, you got to take a, a decent bit of bad with the good. And I shouldn't even say bad, but how about just repetitive? <laughs> I see and I'm remembering that the latches actually pop up on your map with each round of enemies down. Oh, okay, so we'll do it again. One more. Two more. One more. I don't remember how many barrels there are. Actually, I think there might be one more. Not in within range to do anything. I would love to do something. There, there's the latch. All right, Evelyn is just taking care of business, thankfully. barrel is he I'm gonna pick up a few things before leaving okay before before completing this here there we go easy I'm just trying to find out what happened is that Sarah Hawk you have enemies I'm glad it's you really <sighs> these poor people you are a much better target. You stole the Gadlock. What, to sell? Justify yourself. Kanari take my people. My siblings forget their culture, then go to the Kune for purpose. We're losing them twice. So I get some help from your people. We'll take the Kanari Thunder, make some accidents, and make them hate it. But this... This is all wrong. Which of my people put you up to the theft? It can still work. They're hidden in your city. They'll enrage the faithful and make sure the Kunari are blamed. Me, I'm finished. I just need a few more bodies. A few more. Well, all right, that was spoken in riddles, but um, revealed that we're still in it, in the thick of it here with the Kunari over with it yet so I'm getting all lost here okay and there the elven fanatic I, I <laughs> didn't know if she had a name or not but That one, Meryl. Good. This one here. Oh, I meant I wanted to do something. Never mind. <laughs> hmm. All right. Well, we took care of that. 
unfortunately, the quest, or fortunately, the quest is not done yet. But I think after I take a look around here, I'll probably call the video and we'll continue on next time. Just want to make sure. Yes, I think we're good to go. All right, guys, I'm going to stop here. Let's just see what is ahead. Bring news of the fanatics to the Arashok in the Kunari compound by the docks. Hmm. Maybe we'll just do that first. Oops, nope, as I go the wrong way. So I do have a few minutes here. Hmm. Broken game. Okay. <laughs> Wait. Oh, crap. I'm going the totally the wrong way. That's creepy. Uh, Jesus Christ. I go up here. Do I open these doors? Yes, I open the gate. Dumbass. All right. Let's. Oh, there's. That's right. That's where we came in. I think we can just leave. Oh, I should have just stopped when I had the chance. Jeez. All right. Let's run back to. Um, the docks and talk to the Irish shock. And then perhaps we'll continue on next time. Hopefully button this up nicely. Although I feel like that's just not possible. In. Enter if you must. I'm afraid that I must because I have to talk to the Arishok. So, I was wrong about our thief. It appears so. They say we were careless with our trap, that this is our fault. But even without the Sarkamek, there would have been death. This elf was determined to lay blame at our feet. But your feet didn't do anything wrong, did they? Selfishness, want, deny. <laughs> How do you allow this to continue? If you dislike Kirkwall so much, why haven't you left? Since we arrived, I have seen nothing but greed and weakness. Dwarves, humans, elves, just festering. No order, no goal. You are one of the few I have met with any ability. And yet this too was random, a result of selfishness. I cannot fathom how a mire like this can be justified. You say we should leave, but how can you bear to stay in this chaos? My welcome to the city was not so different from yours. And yet you suffer it. It's an opportunity to make a real difference. Karisten are soldiers. The Kuhn made it so. They can never vary from that assigned path, never be other than they are meant to be. But they are free to choose within that role, to accept and succeed, or deny and die. Glory is clear and defined. Could you, could not this entire city benefit from that certainty? How else will you know when you have made a real difference? He's free to choose to obey. That isn't contradictory to you. He chooses to be. As do we all, long before any of your meaningless freedoms are presented. Your kind may force our role to change, if the Kuhn demands. She was angry to see her people losing their culture by claiming yours. We accept those who submit to the Kuhn. The weak naturally seek the strong. It doesn't matter. We did not come equipped to indoctrinate. I am here to satisfy a demand you cannot understand. It's been a long time. It will take as long as needed. No ship is coming. There is no rescue from duty to the Kuhn. I am stuck here. That is not the understanding of city leaders and their supporters. Let them rot. Filth stole from us. Not now, not the Sarkamek. Years ago. 
A simple act of greed has bound me. We are all denied Parvolin until I alone recover what was lost under my command. That is why this elf and her shadows are unimportant. That is why I do not simply walk from this pustule of a city. Fixing your mess is not the demand of the Kuhn, and you should all be grateful! Thank you, human, for your service. Leave. That's an oxman ready to charge. The Viscount should know. Hmm. Indeed, that was a bit intense. Not entirely sure he explained the situation any better, but it does give an idea as to why the Cunari are still in Kirkwall. All right, guys, but we will pick this up next time and continue trying to solve this strange little mystery as it were here in dragon age 2 thank you so much for watching this particular episode and i hope to see you next time take care bye bye